following this case for like many many years and he has like the pill like the like the bag of like those weird pills or whatever yeah. or those weird seeds and basically that's like him like younger like going through the cases that he was talking about like and how he got like that that scar on his face too so it's basically pulling a red dead redemption and the sequel is the prequel <gasps> spoiler i didn't know that you didn't know that? No, I didn't know that. Oh, it is, yeah. Well, it's a spoiler. <laughs> like, uh, it has John Marston, like, when he's young. Um, it, like, has a lot of his backstory in the game. So but then, you don't play as him. Let me guess, he's, you you work underneath the Dutch. Dutch, yeah. It's basically, they in the first game, it's like, you're playing John Marston, working for the government to go kill the people in your gang. Resident, or, not Resident Evil. <laughs> uh, Red Dead Redemption 2. Skip this, dude. <laughs> I don't want to see oh, this ever again in my life. Oh, Anna. <laughs> she, she's like dead on the tree. Oh, I know. <sighs> but uh, it's like going through Dutch's gang and everything. But let's load this game. Let's play... Two games. Chapter three. Oh, I hate this game. I love it. To previously on the oh, yeah. investigation. No, the best thing about he's this game... He's in the Bronx. This is from the prequel. The prequel. Remember this game. Remember. I met this attractive police officer and the sheriff is a dick to me i'm sheriff a woodman george woodman something's definitely going wrong in this town do you feel it zach do you feel it zach the coffee said fk fuck <laughs> the coffee said fuck you <laughs> because this game sucks look it's it's whatever heath lethbridge's is just joker oh yeah it is so does it just lo- does it play that video every time you start the game? Yeah, it plays like what, how the most far, recent one. How far you are in the game? Yeah. Okay. Because I was like, I know we played a little bit uh, before, and we were talking about Twin Peaks spoilers, and I was like, no, we're I, we're not gonna talk about this. We're not we're gonna stop because season three. I don't want to get spoiled, and I don't, I don't give like a fuck see- about season three. <laughs> season three fucking blows it is, asshole. It's all a dream. <laughs> it basically is. They should have never made a season three. Like, it really is just not good. What the fuck are you doing? Holding my breath. Fuck! Fuck! Dude, you better just run. (laughs) You... You're not gonna get around. (laughs) Just shoot him, dude. Just shoot him. You have infinite ammo, dude. Just shoot him. Nice purple. shot, nice purple blood, purple blood, purple blood. You're dead. Nice, nice, nice. Gucci, good, nice, nice, huh. nice, baby. Oh yeah, this is a game. <laughs> <laughs> this is a game. <laughs> this is some game right here. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Just shoot. Look, 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 look. I'm having a rave. Oh my! Oh, it's reaching down my throat. <laughs> what the fuck? Get it off. Shouldn't I say get it out? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck deadly permanition. <laughs> Apparently, a lot of people. This is like just one of their favorite games. It's a. Uh, I feel like uh, like people mistaken this for like Yakuza, where it's like so bad it's good. You know, Yakuza is because not so bad it's good. It's some some of it. In Yak, some of the things in Yakuza is kind of like dated and stuff. But uh, I still play it. It's a nice little game. Basically, people mistaken like this game for like maybe Dead Rising One or like the Yakuza type of feel, where it's like yeah. very niche. Because, I mean, it's like, very niche because Yakuza. There's I know there's some people that don't even like Yakuza at all, and they're like, eh, "What's this? What's this? It's too niche for me." Oh yeah, I'm sure. I'm I sure want AAA some, developing right now. I'm sure somebody who loves to play NBA 2K14 like doesn't understand Yakuza. Yeah. Like as somebody who just plays Madden or like Fortnite, they're not gonna understand Yakuza. Exactly. Yakuza is definitely for a more mature gentleman gamer. Yeah. Or someone who isn't an idiot. Yeah. If you're an idiot, you're not gonna like Yakuza. I want I want the games that appeal to the masses. Fuck Dude, get out of this hospital. I wanna see some story. Hell yeah, dude. Nah, You're gonna get killed. I have infinite ammo. I know, but you keep getting 
Attacked. You use. Oh, like... what the fuck! I never seen this. Oh. Oh, you better run, dude. Like, you use like four health packs, and there's only one left. You're right. <laughs> like you're getting destroyed. You need to take this game seriously. Do you know where you're going? Nope. It's been a while. You should just Fuck shoot off. them all. Fuck off! You're dead. We already lost half the health again. I need to get out of here. I don't know how, dude. Right, is this? Do the gameplay sections like this? Or are they just kind of like straightforward? Yeah. It's not like you get lost. Yeah, you don't get lost. Okay, gotcha. This is, uh... This... What about, uh, the axe guy when he shows up? Uh, those, those, like, areas are pretty linear, too. Okay. This is this hospital place. It's kind of, uh... Kind of Big, dumb. because you were, like, looking for, like, uh... Well, the doctor's not in, and he needs to The hospital out. is way too big. Yeah. Like, why is it so big? The town is, like, three people large. There's a sheriff... A doctor, the the guy who likes to play chess. Yep, yep. Like, there's not a lot of people in this town. There's a dead girl. Like, there's like 20 people max. <laughs> 20 people. Why do they need a hospital that could fit 300? Is that a save? Nope. <laughs> Is it like a item, maybe? Yeah. no items for you or is it just like a little interactive thing yeah a little interactive this game is very very niche you could like look through like the windows like right outside and see what's inside the building and there's no purpose for it there's a lot of things in this game that have no purpose <laughs> this is very that's a save very niche alright time to save and quit the game <laughs> yeah we played enough we've got seven minutes <laughs> Oh, God. Hopefully, uh, the game plays a little bit more polished in the second game. Well, Nintendo seems like they're sponsoring it. I think it's going to be a Switch exclusive. Yeah. So it probably will be. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. I, I'm at the, be <laughs> the beginning. <laughs> what do you mean? How much is that? $35. $35 for a cracker? Man, it's a good deal. Oh my. $24 for a lollipop? <laughs> <laughs> Look, the, like you said. The economy's been inflated. This game is basically made by a Japanese person who's never been to America. Is that like Yin? What? You didn't say that. I think I saw that on Funhouse, actually. They were just, like, this game, they said basically that this game is uh, made by a Japanese person who's like never been to America, and this is what they think America is like. Yeah, that's how uh, that's how Dead Rising One is, where they just took. A, it seems like they got a bunch of Japanese developers and went to like a mall and like, oh, oh. So, so this is how a mall is, and then they decided to make like. A what if there were zombies right there? Dawn, right there, right Dawn there. of the Dead <laughs> type of mall experience. That's why sometimes whenever you hear like the dialogue of some Ameri like the American act like the American uh, the American people that were supposed to be an American game they sound super weird and out of place like basically all of them sound like B-movie tiers like er everybody in America is like B-movie tier uh, action superstars yeah they are everybody's an Arnold <laughs> I would be Arnold I would be <laughs> Arnold where's the flash dude is where are you going? I know where to go. <laughs> but I, I know where to go. I don't know where to go. <laughs> oh, God. Out of my fucking way. Oh, my I God. I was wondering. I was like, there's... Why'd you save? You saved at the beginning. And you have no health. Oh. So you basically lost us all that health. And then... And then saved... But he's found me. Oh god, I forgot this has Resident Evil limping. Well. <laughs> <laughs> you buy any lollipops? Twenty. Oh, what the fuck? Uh, 
guess it doesn't do anything. Recovers your hunger. I guess you have hunger. It's not healing you, dude. Okay. You have to use your health. Use the big health. It looks like we have a big health. There we go. That's almost all you're all right now. <laughs> Get out of here, dude. Get a cutscene plan. Yeah. What is that? Doctor's what? table. I don't know. It's like a stretcher. They spawn. Yeah. This looks like the right way. Ooh. I'm holding my breath. For some reason, they don't take me if I hold my breath. They mm. I found you. Fuck that. Dead end. What? A, are you sure? Yeah. <gasps> it's not a dead end. Come back in. <laughs> I thought they were on the ceiling for a second. <gasps> Fuck. I don't know if I go through there. But I'll check down here. Shit! Get out of the way! You're fine. You! 